Hey everybody, Center Stalker here. I'm at the SWAT meet right now. I'm gonna see the kind of stuff they have here. And we're gonna get the hell out and about action. See what kind of weird shit I can find and maybe find some movies or something kind of cool. So let's go see what kind of wacky cool shit they might have. Yeah. Oh man, get some, get some hot dogs and hot wings over at the beer garden right there. Interesting. They have all the kind of cool uh, sodas right here. And like the glass bottles, that's kind of cool. Snow cones, mmm, very good. But who the hell wants a fucking beer at like noon right now? It's like way too early for a beer. It's like uh, one o'clock. It's like, geez, I guess if you're alky or something. Well, it's so good to get the churros. And uh, they're making them right in there. They're frying them up right now. I might have to buy some of those. I love those things. Man, those things are so damn good. I love churros, man. They're sugary goodness. With, you know, deep, creepy, like, mannequin, like, from uh, the movie, like, you know, Maniac or something with you know, either Joe Smanel or uh, fucking the one with Elijah Wood. Kind of creepy. Put a little scalp on it, like the hair. It's fucking disgusting. I call trophy heads, and I found some trophy heads right here. Look at these weird things. What the hell, right? Kind of cool, but creepy as hell, man. I mean, oh, it's interesting. <laughs> Old school, like looking skateboards. You never know, you might find the swap, you know, all kinds of like weird, like little things. Got some sunglasses right here. Yeah, I think I need these sunglasses. I gotta get these. What do you think? I think I need those in my life. I don't know. What do you think? Is it me? Is it me or is it, uh, is it me? I don't know. Like, kind of cool. I think it's a good look for me. I'm gonna have to get these. This is what the ladies want. They want guys to wear this kind of stuff. You know what I mean? That's what I'm missing out on. I gotta do it. Some movies and stuff like that, but the ones I found so far have been nothing but crappy movies, like old like crappy VHS tapes of Titanic and like generic DVDs that everyone has, like Matrix and crap like that that I don't, we don't need. So I'm just looking around on the hunt for that and looking at some weird stuff along the way, and uh, I hope, I'm hoping to find something cool, like a cool movie or something neat, like, like, a, like a nice little hidden gem. That's what I'm hoping for. But let's go see what I can find. Let's keep on doing it. I found like a whole bunch of these cool like old school like party stamps. You get these, you throw them on the ground. Not bad, five for a buck. Might have to just get some just for old nostalgia. What they got here? Oh, they got like um, what are these like sparklers or something like that? They got some sparklers here. Hmm. Barrel o slime. Yeah. Look at these things too. Like, I don't know if you guys remember these. Like these these bomb bags, like you um, you squeeze it and it, it expands and it pops everywhere. It has like this weird like like baking soda or like this kind of like vinegar baking soda, I think it is, and it makes it expand and it pops everywhere. A big old mess. It's kind of neat. Weird like toys in here, like kind of wacky things. What's it over here? These are like this is like the authentic Transformers. You know, it's transformable. That's that's the, that's the authentic Transformers right there. And it's, it's the stuff we have now, that ain't the real deal. This is the real deal, man. This is like a, it's like a Power Ranger looking imitation, like Voltron thing. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> yeah, I found another toy area. So what kind of neat little uh, toys I might have over here. Like some sort of bag of Army Man. Those are always kind of fun. Look at some, uh, some nunchucks, some chakus. Hell yeah. What's the good? Little uh, snaps for like your toy gun, those things. I, I, I still made those things, like a, like a cap gun. Huh, interesting. They have like um, Super Warriors, not to be confused with the Power Rangers. Check these out. Uh, Luna, if you're watching this, we get some uh, Power Rangers right here. Well, sorta. <laughs> get them while you can, they're collectible. Oh my god, look at that. Oh my god. Well, that's, that's pretty cool. Watch out, don't be careful of me. Be careful, I don't want to get shot now. <laughs> Freaking some snow cones right there. And I dig that, it's so good. For 250, it's like about the swap. You got all these like snacks. You got like nachos. All kinds of cool things right there. Bacon wrapped hot dogs. And soda nachos, you get the super nachos. It's like hella good. So this is what I picked up right here for like, for like 550. I get this, this crazy like super nachos thing. It has like, Everything on it. That's like like a ton of stuff right here. I not even eat this damn thing. It's like just 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 fucking covered right here. Holy crap! It looks it's gonna be hella good. Shit. Mm. That's awesome. Look at that thing right there. Just covered. Get some shredded beef right there. Some jalapenos. Some salsa. All fresh. It's gonna be hella good. I tell you that. 
like a little, a little soggy nacho tortilla chips, but it, it, it's still tasty. It's still, just a little bit uh, soggy, but it's okay like that. Kind of like it. Hmm. Uh, damn, I just finished those super nachos, and I am stuffed as hell, man. That thing filled me up. I took care of lunch and probably dinner, too. I'm like, so damn stuffed right now. So I'm about to leave the swat a little bit. Maybe I might find a cool movie or something along the way. I'm not really sure. But um, I'll go look around one more time after that split and maybe go somewhere else. Check out some video stores around town or something. Let's go do it. I picked up this, the churros. I had to do the churro thing. It was like two bucks. I had to get them. They smell so damn good. I'll have them later. I'll have like a little snack or something. But man, they're so damn good. Look at that. The sugar in there. and like I don't know what else in there. Cinnamon and all that stuff. And like fried bread. Ooh, can't get wrong with that. It's so good. Swap me right now. There's nothing, there was like no movies in there to get. Nothing like that. Just looked at some random like weird stuff like imitation toys and like snappers and got some good grub on like so damn full right now. So I'm going to leave here. I'm going to go hit up uh, maybe a video store or something like that and see what else is around town. Just kind of a little, little out and about, a little uh, tour around town, a little fun stuff right there to do on a Saturday. What the hell? I got the day off. Might as well just do that. So let's go do it. Mm-hmm. Off to the next place. Let's make it snappy. Yeah. All right, I'm at the Dallas. Left the swap meet. All right, guys, left the swap meet. I'm gonna go hit up this video store. You know, blow out DVD. I've been here before, so I'm gonna go in there and I'm gonna show you guys a little bit more inside there this time than I did last time. And hopefully, I can find some cool movie titles in there that I can pick up because there was nothing at the swap meet. So I'm hoping in here, I can at least find a couple of things. Let's go see and find out. Let's go do it and see what kind of cool shit I might stock up on. Oh. You walk up to the store right here to have a whole like row full of like DVDs here you can pick up. You know, nothing really crazy like, you know, this thing looks kind of, this might be okay. I don't know what the hell this is, but they're, they're four for uh, 10 bucks right there. So that's, that's a pretty good deal, but you got to like hunt through them and all that and look for them. And I don't get time for that shit right now, so fuck that. But uh, I'm going to go in here and see what kind of uh, stuff they have in here. So let's go inside. Here's all the, um... All the new releases right here. You can check that out. See kind of, I'm not sure anything really good came out though. It's like, fuck, kind of like, eh, basic stuff. So I'm like, eh, nothing much I see that I want to get. It looks kind of interesting right there, but I don't know. And over here, you got all these, like, these um, old ones for sale right here. You got all these like uh, horror movies right here for like really cheap, like. <clears throat> He's got this, for example, you know, 495, and like a bunch of things here, like you know, my buddy Valentine, you know, 3D, 599. That's not bad. There's like some bunch of stuff you gotta kind of thumb through. So I'm gonna look in here and maybe find a cool gem or two. You know, a special interest section. Hmm. But it's not what you think. They have all these uh, wrestling uh, DVDs you can buy here. You know, they're all used, but you know, they're they're kind of cool. Like they have a lot of these like hardcore wrestling ones. You know, CZW. Like some crazy shit, like, like look at this thing, that thing looks, what the fuck, it looks pretty nuts. Gory, hardcore wrestling. Yeah, there's, like, there's like a ton of it here, I was like, I never saw so much ever before, like, at a place, it was like just a ton. Like, whatever, you know, that is, you know, kind of the gross stuff. Just kind of shock value wrestling, but it, it's kind of fun shit to watch. Cult movies right here, all kinds of, like, interesting ones, you know, of course, you know, like, let's see what this is. It looks pretty cool, look at that. Nice. So this is like, I've always liked this section because they always have a lot of cool hidden gems in this little section right here. So I'm going to go see what kind of things they might have. Let's go see what they got. Like, like I don't know what this is. Like, this thing, escape prison. Like, this one looks kind of cool. Like, these these B ones right here. Dang, sixty four ninety five. Holy shit. That's fucking pricey. God damn. But I like that because it's right next to uh, good old, you know, Franken Hooker. And of course, the classic uh, Garbage Pale Kids, the movie, you know, complete crap, but uh, it's, it's fun garbage. All kinds of like cool, like, you know, fun, cheesy things. They have a good amount of trauma movies here, too, like, like weird ones. Like, where's, like, this thing? I never even, look at that thing. It's like some crazy rockabilly vampire, and I never even heard of that. Interesting, though. They have a really good amount of stuff. Shock treatment, you know, that's kind of cool. And here we are in the awesome horror section right here. Um, I have a pretty good amount of horror here, like, um, I guess like some thriller too, but it just continues over here. Like these, like, like the end of it. 
but it's like a whole like real row and a half of horror. So let's let's go check it out. Some cool titles, huh? Let's see what we have here. Good old unhinged. Hmm. Looks pretty interesting. I'm about to get that. What else they have here? Good zombie honeymoon. Zombie five. I never seen that one, but I heard it's kind of cheesy fun, but I don't know. What else they got? This little vineyard. This is, this is a pretty good one right here. Kind of, kind of weird and gross some parts of it, but it's a uh, it's fun stuff right here. I guess that's a good one to check out right there if you haven't seen it. The vineyard's pretty cool. I'm gonna get some of the prom night movies. Prom night two. Hello, Mary Lou. <laughs> um, a cheese ball. Prom night three. What else they got here? The old the old psycho too. <laughs> Let's see what else they got around here. That was a good movie right here, Death Ship. Um, that's a cool one. In case you haven't seen, I got this one. It's like this uh, ghost story, like on this uh, abandoned uh, Nazi ship. So um, yeah, check this out. It's really good. George Kane in it. You know, kind of slow burn, but it's it's good stuff. There you go. Got the gate on DVD. The old cover. I wish the new one they did had that cover on it. I think this is like I think Canada or something put this out. There's no extras on it, but um, some chapter selections. If you want those or interactive menus, those are extras. Mm-hmm. That's cool. That cover art that was so wicked. Great movie too. Check this out if you haven't seen it. I like part two also. That, that's pretty fun. God, this movie right here. Disturbing movie. Like I think this is. Yeah, this is the R-rated one. If you get your hands on the unrated one and check this thing out, it is like totally fucked up movie right here. Crazy shit. Um, I saw it with a friend of mine like a couple months back, and I was like, God damn, it's pretty crazy. But yeah, pretty. If you like really gory stuff and disturbing movies, check out Rear Set Pieces. I wonder where these steps go to. Mmm, creepy. Here's like all the um, all the Blu-ray rentals they have here to rent. I have a good amount of selection of Blu-ray to rent out here. All kinds of things. Here we go, right there. I've never seen this one. I was just curious about this one. I always see it the the final the final countdown. You can't see it there because that sticker's in the way, but. I was just curious about this thing, if it's any good or not. I'm not sure. I'll have to rent that out or something. See how it is. Of course, a classic Escape from New York. I love that movie. <clears throat> Enemy Mine. Oh my god. I remember this thing. I used to watch this all the time on HBO when I was a kid. I have a cool, weird uh, movie with uh, Louis Gossett Jr. as an alien. So there, there you go. He gives birth in it, too. <laughs> kind of weird. Yeah, the blowout DVD. I picked up about three, about four things I picked up. Oh, I was three, but it was four things I picked up. So I'm gonna show that later on in the video. So let's go off to the next spot and see what kind of things I might capture. Let's do it. All right, everybody. As you can see, I'm over at Best Buy right now. I'm over here real quick to see if there's a, there's a certain box set right now that's on sale for $19.99. So I'm gonna go in there and hopefully they have it still. They probably don't, but it's worth a shot, right? So let's go inside and hopefully they have what I'm looking for. Let's go. So I found what I'm looking for. You got the Planet of the Apes, the complete, you know, original movie box set right here. It says $40, but right now it's $19.99 to get all those blues. Planet of the Apes, I mean, that's fucking killer, man. I got to get that shit. I am getting super that happy. And I got my, you know, Planet of the Apes, you know. I'm going to go look around here and sell this kind of stuff they might have. Maybe some other good deals, huh? Let's go do it. Let's see what they got. Your regular, you know, TV shows, basic things like that. Nothing I really watch. I mean, don't watch these uh, TV shows that much. Like, you know, he's bound down. I've watched it a couple times. It's, it's pretty funny though, but I never really got into it. And Game of Thrones, I, I just never got into that show. I don't know why. Like, I saw the first season, but other than that, I just kind of like lost interest. So let's go see what they have. You know, these, like, you know, all the uh, the tins right now, they're all on sale for seven ninety nine. You know, all, you know this, all the steel books. Which are pretty, it's a really good deal right there. Like, you know, Goodfellas, you know, classic movie, all these other ones right here. But I don't get still books that much, but uh, that, that's, that's pretty sweet though, especially for the uh, Batman ones. That's a, that's a really good deal right there. Good old classic Barbarella on Blu ray for um, shit, $7.99. That's a really good deal for that right there. You can't go wrong. Especially on Blu ray, shit, it's fucking cool. Right here, I don't know what this is. It's kind of cool. I like that cover, Mr. Jones. I never. I've heard of this one, but it looks pretty neat. Might be pretty good. Like, was it like uh, $10? So, 
It looks kind of cool. I thought I'd check this out sometime. It's pretty wicked. I think this one next to it, too. House of Dust. Pretty cool uh, cover art right there, too. Kind of like a ghost kind of story or something. Yeah. yeah. Both of those look pretty sweet. Not bad. The Zombinator. It is the Zombinator. He'll terminate the zombies. Yeah. But look at this thing. I don't know what the fuck this is. I guess he's like a... He hunts uh, the ultimate weapon against an army of undead. Oh my god. Holy shit, look at this, look at this. I don't know what this is, but uh, that'd be kind of some fun cheese. All right, it's got a Best Buy. I'm gonna go, you know, I'm super, super happy because I got the Planet of the Apes complete movie box set for $19.99. I mean, you cannot go wrong with that. What a steal. So I'm gonna go show you what else I picked up and stocked up on. Let me show you what I got. Mm hmm. Start off with this first right here. The Planet of the Apes, you know, complete Blu-ray, five film collection set for $19.99. I mean, what a steal right there. Awesome. I'm glad I have that now. And the next thing I picked up over at uh, Block DVD is this one right here. Double feature of this. The Devil's Men and Terror right here. Put out by the good people of Scorpion Releasing. This looks pretty cool. I just, uh, it was like a used, I bought the rental right here for like about, I don't know, like eight bucks or something like that. But uh, this looks really fucking cool. Donald Pleasance in there. Peter Cushing. You know, kind of a, you know, this looks fucking cool, this shit. Awesome. I love that cover art. Next thing I picked up uh, was this right here. It was uh, Britannia Hospital or Britannia Hospital. Looks kind of weird. Malcolm McDowell in this movie. I never heard of it. Just looked pretty wicked looking. Like, look at the back of that thing. Like this bloody looking corpse guy with like, you know, I don't know what the hell's happening. But that was like, like $11 or something like that. So I picked that bad boy up. Next one right here. So I picked up this classic, The Mechanic. I know it's coming out on Blu-ray from uh, Twilight Time, I believe. But I wanted to get this anyway just to have it. Um, you know, just got on this set right here. I heard it was really... I've never seen this movie before. I heard it's really good. Deranged Duncan told me to pick it up. So I'm like, fuck yeah, I'm going to get this thing. You know, you can't go wrong. You know, Charles Bronson, he's like the man. You know, Death Wish himself. And uh, last but not least, I picked up this... Uh, Four pack cult movie marathon, you know, right here. Another rental I picked up over there. I bought a DVD. Has, you know, Psycho uh, Angels from Hell, Shatterbox, Savage Island, and The Naked Cage. This looks really fun and cheeseball. You know, awesome, cool shit by Shout Factory right here. I always wanted to get this. Is, I think this has been out for like about a couple of months now. I've been kind of putting it off, and I, I got it for a really good deal today, too. I think it was like $7.99. I was buying the rentals and stuff, so awesome, awesome deal. So I picked up all these right here. I, you know, I stocked up on some fucking goodies. I went nutty a little bit, so I'm super, super happy, super pleased. Awesome deals all the way around. I can't wait to check these out. <laughs> a little video right here, just you know, around town, cruising around town, checking out a swap meet earlier, going to a video store. Then Best Buy and picking up some awesome movies. I mean, it was a fun day for me, a little fun afternoon, Memorial Day weekend style on a Saturday. What the hell? Can't go wrong with that. And um, you know, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you do, give me a thumbs up. And you can always, uh, like I said, always say, hit me up on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. You can always follow me on there and ask me questions about videos or just about me or anything else like that. And I'll catch you guys next time. See ya.